First look here at Ludwig Ha. The freshman from Oslo, Norway, up to Joel Jenna Tween. And nice find. Chris Wilkie walking in and knocked away by Bitzer at the last moment. First real chance of this contest. That centering pass fanned on by Wilkie. Colton Poolman, a strong blast blocked back to center ice. This third defensive pairing now on the ice for North Dakota. A different one this evening. A couple of true freshmen back there, and Andrew Pesky gets his pocket picked. Marinaccio, top shelf for Philip Marinaccio, and Bemidji State strikes first. Just four minutes and 58 seconds into this contest. You just were talking about how important that first goal was going to be, Jake. And that they were really focusing on, but again, uh, if you're Bemidji State, this is exactly the start you're looking for. And they make it to the blast from Brett Beauvais, squirts through Cam Johnson. And Bemidji State takes a 2-0 lead with 10.41 left in the first. But again, they've already knocked off the team that was picked to win the conference. Another wraparound chance there, Besser nearly. Loose puck in front that Bitzer was able to knock away. Oh, a moment ago, nearly made it 2-1. Well, Besser does a really good job there, just getting around the defenseman there. This just is going to miss far post. Now it comes away. Charlie O'Connor going the other direction. Nate Arts, or Cal Bauman, excuse me, back. Shot off the pipe. No goal. Great opportunity for O'Connor. Had Johnson beat. Philip Marinaccio, the opening goal scorer, gets it picked away this time by Besser. Here comes Brock Besser going the other way. Besser leaves it for Jost. Great save by Bitzer sliding across to deny the freshman the goal. It's been a long time coming here, as you said, a little quiet this evening in Grand Forks, as you'd imagine. UAV trailing 2 0, but now a 5 on 3 advantage and a goal! Brock Besser with the snipe! And it is 2 to 1! Woman does a heck of a job. He knocks that down. Patiently gets it over to Besser. Besser does a good job. A good chance to see it in action right there. Here's Besser again outside the dots. Another wrister. Jost there on the rebound. Tyson Jost. Still loose in front. Besser again. The slapper this time. Knocked down. Goals last season for Besser. We thought Jost nearly at his third of the year. Oh, just short. End-to-end -end action here is coming the other direction is Brendan Harms. Leaving it back, Fitzgerald saved by Johnson. Big wind up from Jerry Fitzgerald, who remember scored three times last season against North Dakota. Old Janet Tween and again fresh off a hat trick last week against RPI, leaving it for Colton or Casey Johnson. He loses it now and now two on one going the other way. Patiently here from Jay Dickman. That shot saved by Johnson. Dickman with goals in back-to-back -back games coming in. Looked like Pullman was waiting a moment for somebody to hey, enter the play. Nobody was coming, so he wound up. Now a shot, and finds the back of the net! Brock Besser on the backhand! A brace from Brock, and we're not at number two! Knocked back, unable to be controlled by Beauvais. Here comes Besser, short-handed. Brock Besser on a hat-trick off the pipe! A penalty coming, though, delayed against Bemidji. Johnson leaving his net extra attacker out there for UND. Five on five on the delay. And finally the Beavers get the touch. What a chance though for Besser. Penalty shot, folks. Oh, baby. Besser one for two on penalty shots a season ago. And here we go. Besser on Michael Bitzer. Unbelievable here, Brock Besser gets the second consecutive hat trick in this building for North Dakota. Watch this again. Just leaving Bitzer shaken in his boots right there. Besser, remember, scored a hat trick against Bemidji in this building a season ago. He does the trick again tonight. Extra man again out there for the Beavers, six on five with Bitzer on the bench. White Cloud over to Fitzgerald. That shot reaching Johnson. No rebounds though allowed for Cam tonight. Time running short here for Bemidji. Seven seconds to go. O'Connor knocked away. 